what's up guys how are you doing i hope you're great so today in this tutorial i'm going to show you how you can use geopandas to plot a shape file so i have my shape file here in this folder it is called districts as you can see it's here and then i want to use geopandas to open this shape file and then i should be able to to visualize it here in my under corner platform so what you should do first you should import geopandas and then we import geopandas import geopandas as gpd import geopandas as gpd and then from there i want to read my file my, my shape file i'll say gpd dot dot read what dot read file and then i'll open and close brackets and then i'll i'll put in the location the file location my file is in this folder called dist and then and it's called districts.shp so i'll say dist and then districts.shp so that is the shape file format and then i'll run it once i run it you see it returns for me what it has read and then you see these are the contents of my shape file though they are returned in the form that is similar to a pandas data frame i think you are familiar with pandas data frames if not you should check out our tutorial on pandas data frames so what i should do first is to assign a variable to this data i have read which i'll call i'll call it shape file call it shape file yeah shape file should be that so as you can see you can be able to access this shape file from anywhere and then the next thing we should do is to import matplot dot pyplot as plt or oh import matplotlib it's matplotlib.pyplot as plt so the next thing we are going to create we are going to the next thing we are going to do here is to create a space where we are going to 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 to, to draw our what our shape file and then we shall use batplot we shall first set up the axes we shall say fig and then axes will be equal to plt dot subplots subplots and then you can see this is this is where we are going to plot our shape file but it is still small so i would like to increase on its size so i'll say fig size fig size fig size equal let me use 15 by 15 wow 15 by 15 is quite big let me use by 10 10 by 10 yeah this is relatively smaller so that's the first thing we do and then the next thing we are going to do is to come and look at our data set which is shape file and then see what it includes so here we shall see that we have a column for shape length a column for shape area and then a column for households and then uh, let us first plot it on let us first plot our shape file to plot our shape file we shall need to call the shape file which is shape file dot plot open brackets and then specify the axis which we are going to plot it on which is a x so this is our shape file as you can see yeah we've plotted it but we can try to make it more beautiful and more beautiful and more beautiful actually i've just gotten a random idea why don't we just try to plot these households and then see let us visualize these households and then see how this will look so to do that i'll say shapefile.plot dot plot yes and then i'll specify the column column is going to be this column 
which column the household this one this household and then you pay let me just paste it here let me see oh supposed to be a data frame something like this yeah and then i'm going to put a c map i hope you know a c map which will be blues 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 let me see yeah this is what i wanted to show you so I'm trying to create something which is like a coral. What I'm trying to create something is like a coral place. Oh, I don't know that word. Okay, that map. So, yeah, this is what I'm trying to create. And then, yeah, but before we continue, let me just put off this title. Just say ax dot axis. No. So before I continue, I just want to put off this outline. It's not making sense for me. So I'll just write ax dot axis and then I'll say off. Yeah. So it's off actually. Let me try to put a title and then we see how it will look like. So I'll say ax dot set dot set dot set title or title is single T. And then this is the title a map I'm just putting a title a map showing showing what households households oh it is supposed to be a x not a s oh, but it is still small so let us try to increase it to increase it, I'll need to create the a font dictionary. Font dict. So this this is a dictionary that that is going to include what we shall use to style our font. So I'll say, let me try to say font. Yeah. So as you can see, I've tried to increase this the the the. the the size of the title so we can do more and more and more and more i'll show you more in our next tutorials this is just an introductory to geopandas don't forget to subscribe to this channel see you soon